Now I gotta start over. What is this world coming to? Dinner is in the crowd. Good morning or good early afternoon. It is 11 o'clock. Shaylee just left for school. Um, oh, okay, let me show you something. I have got a roast in the crock pot. It has some onions in there and some seasoning. Um, I made some coleslaw last night uh, for a family dinner and we have a ton of leftover coleslaw so I was like, oh, so I took out a roast before the dinner last night thinking I bet we'll have leftovers and if we do we'll have the same meal. We went to my mother-in-law's and we had Moab tacos and so this morning I asked Eric, I said okay I have this roast so I'm going to put it in the crock pot. Do you want Jana's roast? I'll link the recipe so good. Or do you want Moab tacos again like we had last night? He goes oh I want more Moab tacos. So that's what we're having. That is in the crock pot. So easy dinner tonight. Moab tacos shred up some beef, put it in a flour tortilla or a lettuce wrap with coleslaw. Yum. I'll put a link to that video. Um, so Shaylee just went to school. We, um, this morning, where you saw that lovely snow, it's snowing here, we went to go visit a cousin of ours, um, who's Derek's age, and she was in town and she was leaving to go to the airport this morning. So I went to go see her before she took off. Um, there's a big brunch at my mother-in-law's house today, like right now, but with the snow and with Shaylee leaving for school, I would not make it in time when Heidi had to leave. So I went and saw her this morning. So now <laughs> my house is thrashed. You wanna see what we're up to? Oh my goodness. Okay, I have like half of Shaylee's room out here. It's, it's crazy. Because if you remember, we're switching rooms so here is where the office is going to be now i've switched the closet over which this closet is smaller than the other closet so that's a bummer for me but here it is here uh I'm derek's this will be derek's space we're looking for a desk for him here and he's going to have shelves i would like a shelf um and then I, i'm going to get another shelf right here to put all my baskets of norwex free product in there all my inventory so we're starting on that. Here's what the office looks like now. Trying to go through stuff, move it over. My goal is to have this cleared out by the end of the day so we can get Shaylee's bed in here. So wish me luck on that. Um, so we still have our dresser out here. So these coffee tables we don't need anymore. So I think I'm going to sell them. So I have to go through those and get everything out. Um, and let me take you downstairs. So we uh, picked up these bunk beds from my in-law's house. Um, so we have these bunk beds here, but we're going to use them as separate beds for the boys' room. So that's exciting. And the bed that Boston's using is actually Shaylee's bed, so she'll get that bed back. So, um, And then, I didn't show you on yesterday's vlog, the bean bags. So here are the bean bags that we got from Walmart. They're super comfy. A grown-up can sit in them. They have a backing on them, so you have a little more oomph. They squeeze you on the sides. So I grabbed three of those. I think they were $30 each. So it works in this space so well. So we're excited about it. Hey, and there's no couch, so there's no cuddling with the teenagers. Right, right, yeah. So okay, so I still have to go through those toys. That's going to have to wait. <laughs> So I'm going to deviate off course. I am not going to work on my morning routine right now. I have to get that office switched over because I am leaving this weekend. Anyway, we'll, I'll get into that with you. So I have a lot to do. i got to switch that bedroom and I have to um, help Kelly with her PE class. She takes that online. So we have a lot of stuff that I need to do and I still need to call some of you, my new consultants, and <laughs> I haven't done that yet. 
it's just so busy and I'm feeling overwhelmed today, but right now I'm just gonna concentrate on Callie's PE class and switching these rooms, so. <laughs> but I gotta remember to eat. I haven't eaten yet. I do that, I have to eat. So, yeah. That is my life today and it's Monday. Tuesday for you, Monday for me. Feels like a Monday. <laughs> oh well. I am the queen of multitasking. I'm probably not getting everything done efficiently, but this is what I do. I don't know if it's the ADHD or type one, I have no idea, or if it's just me being Kimmy, but this is what I'm doing right now. <clears throat> I'm eating some leftover Kentucky Fried Chicken. I put it in the broiler too long. It's a little crispy on top, but it's so good. And I am having it with this cilantro lime dressing that I made the other night. Oh, it's so good. Really yummy. So I'm having that. I just started The Walking Dead. And I'm still working on getting Callie's assignments out for her PE class online. I freaking hate it. So I'm doing three things. I'm almost done helping her post this assignment. And when that is done, I will switch and get some stuff in here. And it is noon and I'm feeling stressed. But dinner's in the crock pot. Dinner is in the crock pot. I have jeans on, you guys. Check me out, I have jeans, boots, a nice shirt. I have a bra on, it's freaking amazing. Yeah, this is like super duper fancy for me on a Monday, a Monday of all days. Holy cow. So okay, I'm gonna finish, but I wanted to check in with you. What are you guys doing? Tell me below, what are you doing? Right now as you're watching this, what are you doing? Are you folding laundry? Are you cleaning a bathroom? What are you doing? So the bookcase fits in our closet, Yep. so I think we might keep it there for a while, see what yeah. we could do for organizing your stuff with it. Them all. Yeah. Them all. Still gonna finish cleaning in our yeah. closet, yeah, yeah, yeah. that'll come. I got this the Christmas. I gotta find a place in the wall for that in my office. I got this Christmas. Yes you did. So right now I'm just gonna vacuum mm -hmm. her room and we're gonna get in the car and get the kids. So let's get the yeah. school vacuumed, yay! My subscribers hi asked me in the video that's up today um, yesterday for you called what we do at party something like that I don't even remember <laughs> she asks what is my total morning routine okay my morning routine consists of making the bed wiping down the bathrooms um, emptying the dishwasher from the night before um, starting a load of laundry Bed, wipe down bathrooms, load of laundry. What did I say? Oh, now I gotta start over. Make the bed, wipe down the bathrooms, start a load of laundry, unload the dishwasher, think about dinner, especially if I'm doing a crock pot meal, check my calendar. And if any garbage needs to go to the garbage can, that goes to the garbage can. So seven major things that need to get done in the morning. Yep, that's my total morning routine. And then in the morning, I pick the chore that's for the day, like one big chore for the day. And that's what I try to get done before noon. 
And so any deep cleaning, cleaning the bathrooms, any of that gets done. Hopefully before noon. That way I can work on YouTube, I can work on my Norwex, I can be a mom to Shaylee when she's home and not at school. So, yeah, good question. Oh my gosh, you guys. Right now in the United States, we get to vote for a new president in November. And right now, during all the primaries and all the hoopla and uh, debates, it really gets my heart pumping. Like, I can't stand... I used to never be involved in politics until, like... Oh, I don't even know. Since 2004, maybe I've been really involved in what's going on in our country and where we're going and where we need to head and where we're heading that doesn't look so good. And I want somebody that knows the Constitution, that knows the country, knows the fundamentals of this country, and really know their stuff on that and be able to carry our country through. And someone who is a stickler when it comes to defending this country who won't put up a crap and that will defend the Constitution and right now like there's all this talk about Donald Trump oh my gosh he wasn't supposed to come this far he just needs to go away because he's driving me crazy like there's no way in heck I'm voting for Donald Trump holy crap holy crap those are my thoughts and that's probably all you're gonna hear on that subject <laughs> it really gets me fired up Anywho. Yeehaw! We're having Oreo cookies for a snack today. Dunk it. Did you dunk it? Did you dunk it? You gotta dunk your Oreo. You, you dunked. I see crumbs in yours. Callie is all over this. This is her favorite snack. Jonah's in heaven. He likes to submerge all of his cookie in there. So do I. Yum. So I'm gonna have a little bit of cookies and milk and then get back to work in the uh, PE with Callie. I gotta take pictures of her in certain poses of exercises and submit those. Oh my gosh. I thought, yeah, we'll take PE online, it'll be easy. Psych. My daughter just educated me on something. <laughs> <laughs> Hold the phone. So if I ever say on a vlog, oh, I just, I, I just watched Netflix and chilled. Oh. Literally, I sat in a chair, chilled out, watched Netflix. It was glorious. But no, <laughs> according to teenagers, there's a whole new meaning to the phrase watching Netflix and chilling. When what is that? Callie, you just told me about. And something sinners do before they're married. <laughs> Making out or having an SEX? Both. Oh my god. I think my friend explained it to me and I was like, well, my definition of Netflix and chill is actually watching Netflix with a blanket on myself and a line between the other person. <laughs> you learn something new every day. Well, I just wanted to share that clip with you um, because... We really do try to keep the lines of communication open with our kids and um, cause they, uh, they are subjected to so much at school and on social media and we've always let Callie know from a very young age that if you hear something at school or TV or something and you have questions and you know we've always just said please come and talk to us, you won't be in trouble you know at all, you just won't get in trouble, We, you know if something is You've heard something and you want to know what it is because your friends are talking about it. And especially if it makes you uncomfortable, to please come and talk to us. And um, so I don't even know how this was brought up. We were in the, here in the office working on homework. I don't even remember. But she brought it up and said, Mom, have you? do you know what this means? And I had no idea. I had no idea. I'm like, um, so... I, you know, she brought it to my attention and I was like, oh my gosh, let's share this with other parents. So that's why that clip is in there. Callie's not trying to, the comment she made, um, 
about it's what sinners do before they're married. She was playing Miranda. That's her Miranda voice from Miranda Sings, a character here on YouTube. And so she's not judging anybody. She she was just being Miranda, like using the voice in case you don't know that. It's something that Callie does. And she does it on the vlogs quite a lot. But I thought I better say something so she's not offending anybody because she's not. She's Callie's not judgmental at all. In fact, if I'm being judgmental, she puts me in my place. She's fantastic. So I just wanted to share that with you parents, that there's a lot of stuff going on, a lot of stuff on social media that our kids are subjected to, and I had no idea about the saying. Like, brand new information for me, so I'm glad she said something to me. So, that is that. Let's continue on with the vlog. Okay, just working on their plates. I'm doing paper plates tonight because I don't want to wash any more dishes. So layer the shredded beef into the tortilla. This is really hard to do one-handed. Then you take the coleslaw and just stick it on top. It's so good. If you don't want to make your own, I love the KFC coleslaw on this. It's hard to do one-handed, but then you just roll it up or however you want to eat it. Voila, and that is a Moab taco. Derek is putting Shaylee's bed together. I'm just gonna figure where we want it. Put in the window. She wants it right here. In the window? Yeah. <laughs> we'll get it. Bring gosh. Bring. You're trying to scare me. Yes. <laughs> hmm. So I just rebooted the laundry. It never ends. Keeps going and going. Okay, we're putting the dresser drawers back in. Yeah. She needs dresser. Yeah. She has her dollhouse. Yeah. We're pulling everything into your room, huh? Yeah, with the moves stuff. Yeah, I still need to clear off those shelves. We'll do that tomorrow. Yeah. So this is what is in Shaylee's room, and I'll show it tomorrow when there's sunshine. But it's so cute. It has such a cute saying. And I'll show it to you better with better lighting tomorrow. But that's above her bed. We bought that at that at-home store. Yeah, Mom. So uh, down the road, we're going to paint her bed white. Pink. Pink? Yeah. <laughs> so, pink and then I got to get her curtains out. Those are. Uh, it's a pink. Mm -hmm. It's pink. Yep. I got to hang back up the curtain rod. Hang. Tears as a dry. Okay. Mama? And we'll hang up her curtains. I'll put the rod back up and her curtains yeah. back up. Yeah. We'll try as and we'll try everything. We'll try everything. Yeah, it's dark in here. Okay. So now we are going to bring all this stuff into her room. We're throwing. And you're humming, Mom. Yes, I will. And we're going to throw away this old mattress. Um, it, yeah, it's horrible. So that is going into Can the garage. There. So let's get all your toys in your room, okay? Yeah, you got, you want to see it? Yeah, I'll help you. Okay, I'm going to spray the boys' mattresses with this mattress cleaner from Norwex. It has amazing enzymes in it that are like little Pac-Man that, that go and eat all of the like dust mite poo and, oh, skin. It's disgusting. So if you have allergies and you're sneezing when you wake up or you're stuffy, spray your mattresses, spray your couches, your stuffed animals, rugs. Stuff's awesome. Well, that is today's vlog. I am beat trying to put this house back together. We got Shaylee's room together. Still have to finish those shelves. Put the boys' beds up. They look so good. I'll show you those tomorrow. There's plenty of space under their bed for storage, so I'm psyched. I can't wait to share that with you. So, um, it is late. It is 12.45 a.m. It's tomorrow, <laughs> and I've been just busy working on the vlog and work and other stuff, so I am going to either jump in the shower or go to bed. I'm like debating because I really want a hot shower, and so, ah, crazy. So I kind of feel like this vlog was lame. I don't know why. 
probably because there's not a lot of cleaning or cooking involved in it, but you know, there's just days you just gotta just do other stuff. And today it was rearranging rooms and piecing. Oh yeah. So, but I just felt the vlog was lame, so I apologize, but I hope that you got something out of it. So, I would love to know, leave in the comments below, what did you do today? What did you do? Uh, yeah. I've been in this bra too long. I gotta go. Alright, you guys, thanks for joining me. You have a good night, and we will see you tomorrow.